Peace, family. This is Brother O God from In the Black Hip Hop News. And this story is about um, Jay Z and The Haven, which was Jay Z's right hand man. Um, we all know the song where Jay Z pretty much accuses The Haven of snitching. You know, he says, fuck The Haven for caving. That's why we don't speak. Made man is supposed to make statements. So recently, um, The Haven. You know, Jay-Z's former right-hand man on the street, you know, released a tweet. You know what I mean? Um, basically saying that he didn't snitch and defended his name. You know what I mean? So we see that they got a history from the pictures and all that. But let's get into the story real good. Let's look at this tweet right now, family. All right, so um, the line goes, so fuck the haven for caving. That's why we don't speak. Made men or real men ain't supposed to make statements. The haven took the Instagram and said, in response to the snitching allegations, Okay, Gemini, since you're a twin sign, this must be stupid. One that you made the statement, because I don't understand what you're getting at. So, the fuck with Emery is there. You don't know what the main sacrifice to be there. Emery is his own man. I'm in my own man. Truth be told, Emery wouldn't be there without me. How about that? Cash me outside. So, uh, um, <clears throat> if you can just read there, um, the conversation that going back and forth, and he's vehemently, um, defending. You know, these allegations that he somehow snitched. And um, Jay-Z pretty much holds true to it through his lyrics. And the fact that he's not even dealing um, with the Haven. I mean, there's been videos years ago that got millions of views. You know, with the Haven where he made videos alluding that Jay-Z sold his soul. And that Jay-Z is a part of the Illuminati. And I remember them videos and shit. But y'all gonna take your time to read the um, conversation there. You know what I mean? It's a lot. You can pause your computer, you know, uh, um, to read it. But one thing I will say uh, is observing <clears throat> the whole situation is that it appears, um, you know, that Jay Z is indeed a swagger jacker. Now, Young Chris actually admitted that they all kind of took, you know, stuff from each other. But when you listen to um, Young Chris rapping, you could it's apparent that Jay Z definitely took a part, if not even all of his style and shit, even some of the shit that he said. And I'm I'm the biggest Jay-Z fan, you're probably going to find. But I, um, what's real is real. All you got to do is just listen to some, um, we uploaded videos, you know, with Young Chris, you know, um, rapping, you know, um, and, you know, like, certain, the certain cadence, certain things that he says, like, yeah, and shit, shit, like, that's all the shit that Jay-Z kind of picked up from him now. Um, we got a video up also, you know, called Jay-Z, the biggest swagger jacker of all time check that out there's more examples you know of it you know so um jay-z saying one thing through his actions and his words that the haven basically you know um snitched i mean he tells the whole story with the song with jeezy i done seen it all uh, 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 all. Uh, 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 like a wall he tells it in um i think pray a few tracks on american gangster um on numerous albums he talks about you know the haven um, we know that Emery, you know, um, just got out. Um, Todd, all them cats is running with Jay now. Except for Damon DeHaven and shit. Two cats. But all the cats that Jay came up with, Tata, Beha, uh, um, Kareem, uh, um, all those uh, big time um, Rockefeller uh, uh, um, execs, players, are what Rock Nation is still with Jay-Z. Excluding DeHaven um, and Dame Dash. So... What does that tell you? Uh, you know, you can read between the lines on it. Who went where, I don't know. As far as, you know, uh, who was right, who was wrong. But um, we do know that Jay-Z's almost, you know, close to being a billionaire. You know what I mean? Um, that he has um, started Rock Nation. You know, he's an influential voice. Um, title. All trying to correct, you know, these shitty contracts. Trying to correct the industry. And the exploitation of the artists, you know, at least that's what it appears that it's doing. Rock Nation, you know, um, at this time. So I, at this point, I think we should just applaud it, you know, what he's doing. Um, as far as the Haven, I mean, I wasn't there. I don't know the insides and out, you know, or the story. All you could do is go off um, what a man says. Obviously, Jay Z feels as if the infraction. You know, was large enough to you know not deal with him anymore. Even though, despite the fact that he has pictures, you know, um, 
Jay Z was his, I think it's uh, the Haven's godfather. The the Haven's daughter's godfather. I seen the pictures, and everybody knows they got a history together, and all that. But you know, um, so hopefully one day, these two parties can um mend fences. They can mend fences, um, and you know somehow come together and have a dialogue, you know, about their friendship, you know. So, yeah, yeah, the Haven, um, you gotta defend yourself. I mean, if 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 he did this, there will be paperwork available, and I think that you know maybe Jay don't want to really go that route. He don't want to go that route, but you know, um, if you want to hear more, um, I will uh, direct you to you know, um, American Gangster. He talks about it. Um, the song with Jeezy, I think it's called "Seen It All." I done seen it all. Uh, 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 all oh. like like a wall. He's on there. They talks about the whole thing, and I'm not going to play it here, but you know. Some old videos out there if you're really interested in it, but um, that's my opinion on it. I just hope that one day they could come together. I mean, if not, it is what it is. I mean, you know, two people are not rolling with the rock, two, two that used to be with them out of everybody else. So, you know, count your losses. Dame is still good, looks like the Haven's good. We know Jay and them's good, so we just move on, count your losses, and count it, you know, um, as whatever. But being called a snitch. Um, especially by somebody like Jay Z on wax, all his fans running with it. I don't see why Jay would do that if it wasn't true. But on the other hand, De Haven definitely should defend himself, and that's what he's doing with this article, this tweet. He's defending himself, you know, and pretty much asking Jay Z to put up the proof, you know, that he pretty much, you know, is in fact a snitch. Um, on informant, we heard uh, 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 uh um, a lot. Um, a lot from De Haven. So, and only a few lines from Jay Z. So this your brother, old guy, man, in the black hip hop news. Now hip hop news uncensored. It's really in the black hip hop news uncensored, but you know we just call it hip hop news uncensored for short. Um, our other pages in the black uncensored and in the black media raw. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and please, if you can, I know y'all going to subscribe, but share this video on Facebook for me. Please, please share this video. I'll definitely appreciate it. You know what I mean? Also hit that like button. And you know what it is, boy. It's your boy, oh God. You know what I mean? Um, it is what it is, man. We kill it, man. Hip hop news uncensored in the black for life. Let's go. Peace.